Sup guys, this is Ashank and you're watching TechMate channel. Alright, uh, I got something really interesting for you guys today. Where do I start with? Okay, let, let us say you have a software. I mean, you found this really good software on the internet and you really want to use it. Uh, but the thing is, it's uh, it costs you about a hundred dollars or something, and you don't think you need to spend hundred dollars, or you don't have hundred dollars to spend on the software. Uh, then they have a trial version for you, and you're really happy about the trial version. But then you come to know that this trial version lasts only a week. I mean, you really wanted to use the software, but you can use it only for a week. But uh, right now what if I tell you guys you could use it all your life yes I mean uh, I can give you a tool which will help you use this software all your life without ever having to pay for it right so I'll get right into the business and I hope you guys can catch up with that okay first let's open Google and uh, we type run as date you can see it here run as date Yes, and uh, you open the website, it looks something like this. The Run as Date website. It's the Nersoft website actually, nersoft.net. Nersoft are the guys who develop this tool for us. So let us see. Uh, okay, so description about the software. And this is all I mean, the general stuff about the software. You can just go through it if you really think need. Uh, I mean, if you really want to, but I don't think there's a need to go through all this. Yeah, you come to the feedback section and you will find the download links here. Download run as date and download run as date for 24, I mean, for the 64 bit. If yours is a 64 bit processor, download the 64 one. If yours is the other ones, I mean, the 32 bit, you can download the, the, or the normal one. So yeah, I all you just have to click on that and uh, the download will start automatically. I already have downloaded this file on my desktop. It's right here on my desktop. Yep, it's here. So you'll have a file like this. I think it's the 64-bit version was something like uh, I think the 5 MB download or something. Or I mean, no, it was I think 800 something KB. So yeah, you open the folder, you'll find a readme file, a CDF. You don't need to mess up with all this you just have to go to the application directly double click on the application uh, you have to run it as an administrator so click on run and yeah here right here you have the application window oh, just a second I'll just clean this up so that you guys can look at it clearly yeah right mm, yeah so yeah I already tried it <laughs> so it is going to show you the older one which I open yeah so all you have to do right now is open this cl application to run I've opened the winzip uh, 64 bit one which was a trial version and I wanted to use it forever so okay for example I just click on browse um, I go to my system I go to program files and if I want to use WinZip, I go to WinZip, which is right down here. Click on WinZip. Select the application file. This is the 64-bit WinZip file, which I want to extend. Double click on that. And it is going to store the one. And this section, date slash time section, is the one where you are going to set the time which is going to be displayed in the application the uh, I didn't tell you about the software I should have told you that in the beginning yes uh, the software does not change the time setting or uh, the date setting of your computer it just sends an API to the uh, application which you have chosen and it changes the time and date only in the specific application you it will not change uh, will not make changes to anything else in your system except for the application you have chosen Okay, so today is 26th and if I have downloaded this today and you have a free trial of one month you can just put it to tomorrow or maybe if you really want you can put it any day in the time period you have so let us say it's 26th uh, parameters you really don't need to mess up with all this uh, start and folder you just can leave all of them blank they are for uh, you know advanced mode stuff and you really not, don't need to worry about all that then you say just say create a desktop shortcut you must specify the shortcut name so I say 
winzip no trial winzip no trial uh, then I just say run it's it's running it is going to create a, a shortcut I'm sure yeah it's run and it's created a shortcut yeah right here just a second I'll move this here yes it's created a, a no zip a win zip no trial version now this version is going to last forever I mean you you don't have a trial limit for this version you can use it n number of times yeah I just it'll ask you to give but you really don't need to worry about that so this is the way this uh, it works and yeah I, I had to tell you one more thing and you can access the application only and only from your desktop shortcut because if you are going to use the original application exe file you downloaded from the internet I mean whichever software you're using I have just tried this out right now uh, the whichever software you're using if you try to open the original file or the the one which you've downloaded it is going to count the days down and as soon as your trial is over it will get done but so you have to use this version not the original one this is going to open the same application which you have just uh, applied the software to so this is the way it works you can uh, apply to more softwares I mean some 64 bit softwares uh, cannot be used in this method but most of them do work and if you got some questions you can just post them in the comments or you can just put them on my blog I mean I've linked my blog there down there so you can put them on my blog too and yeah you you you've also put up a written description and more about this tool on my blog uh, you can just check it in the description again so thanks for now and please 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 subscribe uh, it means a lot to us thank you bye bye